Hola familias. Hi, it's Mrs. Yu. It's Superhero Day. All right, tomorrow, mañana Tuesday, martes es el día de deportes, right? So it's your day for your favorite sports team. All right, so I'm going to talk to you a little bit about how to do our Ed puzzle for this week, okay? Vamos a hablar un poco en cómo hacer el uh, Ed puzzle de esta semana, okay? So, sabemos que primero queremos ir a classroom, okay? So, we know that first we want to be in classroom. Okay, so once we are in classroom, and remember, we can get to classroom. Podemos ir a classroom del waffle, to, from the waffle, right? To go to classroom. Entonces, vamos a buscar Mrs. U, right? We're going to go down and we will click on Mrs. U. Okay, very good. And then from there, we're going to click on class work, right? If you are not in Mrs. U's class, you know, estás en la clase de Señor Ryusuzeski, entonces te puedes ir a la clase de la maestra suya. Y entonces, uh, seguir la misma procesa, okay? So you're going to click here on classwork. And then you're going to see reading test, okay? Van a ver donde dice reading test, okay? Prueba de lectora, examen de lectora, okay? Vamos a hacer click aquí. All right. Then we are going to click here where it says Ed Puzzle. So, es muy, muy importante, okay? It's very important that then you click here, okay? Haga click aquí donde dice sign in with Google, okay? So, very important, right? No puedo ver la respuesta si no haga click on donde dice sign in with Google. If you don't click where it says sign in with Google, then I don't know what's happening, okay? I can't see your answers. All right, so then we go sign in with Google. Entonces, la computadora nos toma aquí, okay? The computer will take us right here, okay? So then we need to just click play. Vamos a escuchar. In first grade, we are going to complete Unit 1, Week 3, Progress Monitoring. You will follow the green box as we take this test through an Edpuzzle. Let's get started. Question number one, choose the best answer. Will Sam blank here? A, come. B, good. C, Okay, so ella dice que vamos a seguir las cajas uh, verdes, okay? So we're going to follow the green boxes. And the first question, la primera pregunta dice, will Sam come here, okay? I'm sorry, will Sam blank here? Will Sam good here? Will Sam pull here? Or will Sam come here, okay? Will Sam pull good Will Sam good here? That's the first answer. Will Sam pull here? That's the second answer. Or will Sam come here? Okay, that is the third answer. So you're going to click on the one that you think is the answer. Vas a hacer click en la única que tú piensas es la respuesta. Okay, es la mejor. Okay, so after you put your answer, después de poniendo la respuesta, entonces tienes que poner submit, okay? Submit. Okay, then continue. Say hey, pull. Let me read it again to you. Is it A, will Sam come here? Is it B, will Sam good here? Or is it C, will Sam pull here? Select your answer. Ella está diciendo lo mismo que ya hicimos, ¿ok? So, prob probablemente... Question number two. Había un problema cuando ella estaba haciendo el examen. Ella uh, no dijo todo antes de poniendo seguir, ¿ok? Seguir. 
pero eso fue en el número uno en la pre primera pregunta, ¿ok? Ahora estamos en el segundo. Choose the best answer. This jam is blank. Is it A, B, B, come, or C, good? Let me read it again to you. Is it A, this jam is B? Is it B, this jam is come? Or is it C, this jam is good? Select your answer. Ok, so están diciendo que eso me parece, right? This sounds to me, ok? Um, me gusta comerlo, ok? So si, si, uh, si alguien le gusta comerlo, entonces íbamos a decir esto es, esa palabra aquí, come, venir, esa palabra aquí, estar o ser, be, or esa palabra aquí, bueno, good, ok? This jam is, jam es como algo que puede, puede, puedes poner en pan, okay? Something you can put on, on bread, kind of like jelly. Mm. This jam is come, okay? This jam is be, or this jam is good. ¿Cuál es la, la respuesta, okay? Yo me voy a poner come, y entonces submit. Ok, y entonces continúas como seguir. Look at number three. I will say a word in parts. P -u -ain. What word do you make when you blend these sounds together? Listen to these answer choices. Is it A, lamp, B, plane, or C, pan? Select the picture that has the same sounds as p u -a -n. Select your answer. Okay, so primero tenemos que uh, mirar en esos fotos, okay? Lo que son en inglés. En inglés, eso es un lamp, okay? Dime, lamp. Lamp, okay? Eso es un plane. Plane, okay? Y al fin, this is a pan, pan, okay? So, escucha la palabra. P -u -a -n. P -u -a I'm sorry. P -u -a -n. P -u -a -n. Okay? P -u -a -n. Okay, esa palabra es lamp, plane, or pan, okay? Y mira, esas letras no son en, en el mismo orden, okay? They're not in the same order. This is very tricky. We have A. A es lo mismo como lamp, okay? We have B. B, pero la letra B es abajo aquí, ¿ok? So, si tú piensas que, la, que las uh, palabras p u -e -n dice plane, eso es la letra B y la letra B se queda aquí, ¿ok? It's down here at the bottom. And the last word is pan, ¿ok? Lamp, plane, or pan. Question number four. I am going to say a word. Then I will ask you to change one sound in the word. By changing the sound, you will make a new word. The word is flip. Change to what new word do you make? Listen to these answer choices. Is it A, cap, B, clip, or C, slip? Select the, the picture, that new word you make when you change to select your answer. 
Okay, so in this one, we are changing. The word is flip. Estamos cambiando ese sonido, okay? So no dice ahorra, dice okay? So ahorra tenemos okay? Hicimos la palabra cap, k, app, cap. Hicimos la palabra clip. Ooh, or hicimos la palabra s, ooh, ip, okay? Estamos cambiando, right? Ooh, ip. Ahora dice s, ooh, ip. ¿Cuál palabra dice s, ooh, ip? Okay? Is it cap, clip, or slip? Okay, haga la respuesta, haga clic en la respuesta y entonces submit. Okay, y entonces continue, significa seguir. Choose the word that names the picture. Look at number five. This is a picture of a flag. Read the three answer choices. Select the answer of the word that names the picture. Select your answer. Okay, so the word flag is one of our spelling words, okay? So we are looking for the word here that says flag, okay? So eso es un flag. So estamos buscando la palabra que dice flag, okay? Las palabras que significan flag, okay? Las, las letras que se es escriben la palabra Flag. We are looking for the letters that spell the word flag. That's one of your spelling words this week. Question number six. I will say the name of the picture. Black. Read the three answer choices. Select the word that names the picture. Select your answer. All right, so again, this is black, okay? Remember the song that we have for the word black. <laughs> Spell the color black today. Which one of these words says black? ¿Cuál palabra? Okay, haga click al lado de la respuesta. Y entonces haga click aquí donde dice submit. Okay, click next to your answer and then click submit. Question number seven. I will say the name of the picture. Flat. Read the three answer choices. Select the word that names the picture. Select your answer. Okay, so we are looking for the word flat. Estamos buscando la palabra flat, okay? Flat, okay? Find the word over here that says flat. Haga click a la lado de las letras y entonces submit. For the next three questions, you are going to choose the best answer. Question number eight. Max has six blank. A cat, B cat, C cats. Let me read it again to you. Is it A, Max has six cat? Is it B, Max has six cat? Or is it C, Max has six cats? Select your answer. Okay, Max tiene seis, okay? Max has six. Okay, is the answer. Now, she changed the order. Ella cambió el ordener. It's not the same de lo que ella dijo, okay? Max has six cats here. Max has six cat. Max has six cat. ¿Cuál es la respuesta que necesitamos? Que es la verdad. Okay, vamos a seguir. Question number nine. 
The class ran up to blank. Is it A, hill, B, hills, or C, his? Let me read it again to you. Is it A, the class ran up to hill? Is it B, the class ran up to hills? Or is it C, the class ran up to his? Select your answer. All right, so the question says, La clase corrió arriba dos, okay? The class ran up two, okay? Is it the first answer, his, okay? The class ran up to his. The class ran up to hills, or the class ran up to hill, okay? What is the answer? The class ran up to his, the class ran up to hills or the class ran up to hill? Which one is it? Question number 10. Jill can fill blank for kids. Is it A, packs, B, packs, or C, pack? Let me read it again to you. Is it A, Jill can fill packs for kids. Is it B, Jill can fill packs for kids? Or is it C, Jill can fill pack for kids? Select your answer. Okay, so in este, in este palabra, cuando estamos escribiendo la palabra packs, es como lo mismo de la palabra black, okay? Hay dos letras al fin de la palabra black, ¿ok? Y estamos siguiendo lo mismo como black, ¿ok? When we write the word pack, it is the same at the end as the word black, ¿ok? So, is it P-A-C-K-S? Is it P-A-C-K? Or is it P-A-K, ¿ok? Jill can fill, Jill puede llenar algo por hijos, por nenes, okay? Jill can fill packs, Jill can fill pack, or Jill can fill P-A-K-S, packs, okay? Which is the right spelling, okay? And it sounds correct, okay? Jill can fill blank for kids. Good job, first grade. Way to complete your unit one, week three progress monitoring. Make sure you submit it to your teacher. Have a good day. Okay, so lo hicimos, right? Estamos terminando, right? You are done right here. It says you're finished. Okay, so now tenemos que ir aquí otra vez, right? We have to go back to classwork, okay? Entonces tenemos que clear, uh, hacer click donde dice view assignment, Okay, and then over here, en el lado a la derecha, dice mark as done, okay? Significa hecho, okay? Marcalo como hecho. Mark as done, okay? And we are going to click again. Vamos a hacer click again, mark as done. Okay, and that's it. Very, very good, okay? Yo sé que eso es un poco más difícil, okay? Porque las palabras y que están usando son un poco diferente, okay? So, gracias por su apoyo. Thank you for your help. We know that these words were a little bit different, and this was definitely a little bit trickier. So, we really appreciate your help and your commitment y su dedicación, okay? Muchas gracias. Cuídense. Take care. We'll see you.